Hey everybody, this is Troy. Appreciate y'all joining me once again. I made it to Louisiana. I'm at my brother Sean's house. I'm at Moonshine's Roadhouse. Gotta love the moonshine, right? Well, Moonshine's at work right now, and I had some extra time. Thought I would do a video. I had a special request from Vanesh L. Vanesh L. And uh, she's one of my subscribers. She wanted me to do some fried macaroni and cheese. And I thought I would try to see if I can whip some up. Now usually I don't do the mac and cheese homemade in the house. My wife does. But I thought I would try to see if I could throw something together. So let me show you, let me show you what we got here. Alright, let me show you these ingredients we're going to put in here. And I think this is all of them, but again, I may add some stuff later on. Uh, salt and pepper, of course, y'all know about all that. I'm going to fry up some bacon. I've got some uh, elbow macaroni, just plain, regular size elbow macaroni. Use a little bit of flour and butter. Got some garlic. I'm going to fry it up. I'm going to coat the mac and cheese balls with, uh, and I may not do balls. I may just do some, uh, some kind of like uh, cheese stick looking things, but, you know, we'll see. I'll, I'll see how it looks. But, uh, anyway. I got this Louisiana seasoned fish fry. Instead of uh, panko breadcrumbs or Italian breadcrumbs, I'm, I'm going to use some of this. And I got this, uh, the Trinity they call it. It's a seasoning blend. It's onions, bell peppers, uh, little, looks like a little parsley or something in there. I'm going to throw a couple of fresh jalapenos in there. Dice these up really nice. Um, oh, and the cheese. I got like four, five, six different kinds of cheese I'm going to throw in there. And I'll, I'll mention those cheeses as I add them in. So we'll do that here in a little bit. Right now I've got some water boiling. Got my water boiling from a pasta. And over here is where I'm going to do my sauce in this pot. So let me see if I can get this going. Alright, again, I just got this regular macaroni, elbow macaroni. Water's boiling. I salted it a little bit. There we go. I know I don't need the whole bag, but I'm putting it in there anyway. And just cook it according to the package instructions. You want to cook it a little bit like on the al dente side, a little bit not fully cooked, because they're going to finish cooking when they fry. So uh, this says 9 to 11 minutes. I'm probably going to do it like 9 minutes. So let me set the timer, get this going. And I hope Moonshine doesn't mind me messing up his kitchen, doing some cooking. I'll clean the dishes, don't worry. All right, let's see if we can get us a little bit of uh, butter going in here. And again, y'all bear with me. Uh, this is not my kitchen, so I don't know where everything's at. Got fresh butter here, unsalted butter. Full stick. Half a cup. Half a cup of uh, real butter here. Gonna add this in the pot, let it melt down. Just like that. I almost forgot I need to do some bacon in the oven or you can fry it on the stove top however you want to do it but I'm sticking this in the oven at 350 until it crisps up and then uh, we can put that into the macaroni. Okay I got my butter melted down. I'm going to throw in these uh, two jalapenos that I diced up. Throw in some of this Trinity mix uh, seasoning blend here. Alright, that's about a half of this, uh, I think it's an 8 ounce bag, about half that bag. Need a little garlic in there, of course. Need a little garlic, a couple of these tablespoons, or I'm sorry, teaspoons. Saute all these veggies down, these seasonings. Just sweat them down for a few minutes. Until they get aromatic. Be right back. All right, I just pulled this bacon out out of the oven. It's in there probably about 15 minutes. We'll pour off some of that bacon juice in there. There we go. These have been going on for about four minutes, and they're looking pretty soft. So this is the basics of a roux for the macaroni and cheese, and. Uh, Again, since I'm, in, since I'm in Moonshine's Roadhouse, I don't know where all this stuff is, so I don't know where his measuring cups are. So I put uh, half a cup of butter, plus a little bit of that bacon grease, and uh, I'm just gonna have to wing it here, like I do most of the time anyway. Uh, just regular AP flour. There you go, just regular AP flour. 
See if I can put about a half a cup or so in there. Let's try that. Let's see what that looks like. I'm kind of coming from the angle I'm not used to because I am left-handed. So hopefully y'all can see that. Man, this sure does smell good. I think that's enough. I think I hit it on the head. See there? Excellent, y'all. Excellent. All right, we're just going to cook this for a minute or two. Kind of cook that flour taste out, but you need to keep stirring it because again, this is a roux, and this it's on medium right now because I didn't want to burn that butter, so it's not really, really hot. Just keep stirring it. All right, let me do this. We'll be right back. All right, I think my flour flavor is probably all cooked out. And this, this really does smell good, y'all. All right, let me bring y'all over here. Bear with me. Man, Moonshine, you better hurry up and get home, man. You got to catch up now, boy. All right. Now, ideally, what you do when you're doing your bacon, you get it really, really crispy. I mean, really crispy. That way... You can uh, you don't have to cut it you can just actually just see just break it up just break it up like that just like that so that's all i'm gonna do just break this up get really really small chunks here little bacon bits do another one here real quick and look how that's just it's nice and crispy y'all it's not burnt by any means but it's just, it's just pure goodness right there. All right, let me do the rest of these, and we're going to add them to this flour mixture. All right, uh, Lisa, this is for you, girl. Here's all the bacon. Bacon's looking all happy. Okay, all right. add us some milk. And this is a quart. I got a quart of uh, Klein Peter milk. It's whole milk. Add a little at a time. It's going to be our sauce for the macaroni. Oh yeah, baby. Let's go with some more. Stir it, make sure you don't have any lumps in it. And it's going to thicken up real nice. You could use heavy cream or any kind of a sauce that you'd relish, if you like. But again, I'm at the, the roadhouse today, so I'm just kind of using what uh, Moonshine has here. Trying to wing it. Get some more milk. Spill some more. All right, I'm just going to keep adding milk until I get a nice consistency. So we'll be right back. All right, I wound up using that whole quart of milk, and uh, this is what we wound up with here. Looking really good. And as, uh, as y'all can see over here, I've got it on uh, on this electric stove. It's on number six. So it's, it's like a medium, slightly higher than medium uh, temperature there. And this is, uh, this is new for me, y'all. I don't usually do electric stoves. As y'all know, I have gas. This is looking pretty good. Just for a little extra something something, I'm going to throw in some of this Italian seasoning. Not a whole lot, just a hint. There you go. Maybe a teaspoon or so. Kind of get that in there. I'm going to throw in some of this black pepper ground up. You can, use, you can use white pepper if you want. And we're going to 
we're going to add a bunch of cheese so you don't need a ton of salt but i am going to put a little bit of this ground salt in there all right we can come back and test it later for taste for a uh, saltiness after i add the cheeses kind of let this get happy turn this down to number five medium and this smells awesome it really does really really enjoying this cook right here Lisa I hope you're happy I, I'm doing as you uh, requested and hopefully I'll do it uh, in, in the, the way that you had hoped that I would do it uh, it's pretty doggone thick I may need to water it down just a little bit more. I think I will. Because when I add that cheese, it's going to thicken up some more. Let me get some more milk. Be right back. All right, I'm going to add some more milk in here. Maybe another half cup. Because again, I don't want this to be super, super thin. I don't want it to be super thick either. Because again, when I start adding those cheeses, it's going to thicken up. Get real creamy. I just gave it a little quick taste and it definitely needs some more salt but again we're adding cheese that has salt in it so I'm not going to add more salt at this point. I add some more pepper later on but I, uh, what I did taste was just that hint, just a small hint of, of that Italian seasoning which is, is really nice. It's not strong, not, not overpowering at all but it just adds a little in the background, a little hint of that Italian. It's really really good y'all. Okay, now I've got uh, Philadelphia cream cheese. I've got a, a one block of it that I've kind of cubed up. I'm going to throw that in there. That'll help with the creaminess too. Now I've also got a one pound block of Velveeta that I've cut in half. So I'm using half of a pound of Velveeta and I've cubed these up. I'm going to throw that in there. And I may add some more of the, the Velveeta here later on, but I'm going to see what half of a pound does for for this. There we go. All right, we're gonna melt this down. We'll be right back. All right, I decided to go ahead and add the rest of this half pound of Velveeta because again, I started with a one pound block. So I cubed it up. We're adding that in there. Okay, so that's one full pound of Velveeta and uh, one eight ounce pack of the uh, Philadelphia cream cheese that's in there right now. All right, all this Velveeta and Philadelphia cream cheese is just about melted, almost melted down. See them uh, veggies simmered down and uh, or sweated down in the, the bacon in there. All right, next step. Got some gouda. We're gonna throw a little gouda in there. And this is uh two cups. Might as well use it all. Might as well. Okay, what else we got here? Colby Monterey Jack. Well, uh, say about half this bag. I'm going to put the whole bag in there, y'all. Right. Now we're talking. Sharp cheddar. Let's give it a little bite. Put some sharp cheddar in there. Whole bag. Two cups. There we go. Nothing like mac and cheese. That's cheesy, right? That's what I'm talking about. Might as well. Lord how mercy, this is looking good, smelling good. Okay, we're gonna stir, keep stirring this around. You don't wanna stop stirring it because that may stick on the bottom a little bit depending on the temperature you have. And, and I turned this one down actually, it's about on number four on the on Moonshine stove. Again, I don't wanna risk messing it up because I've, I've never cooked on this stove before. I'm not familiar with it. Uh, anyway, 
let me make sure all this gets melted in. We'll be right back. All right, looks like all my cheese is melted down pretty good. That's pretty thick. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more milk just to thin it just a little bit. Not much. Quarter cup maybe. Let's see what that does. A little bit more milk. Another quarter cup. Yeah, that's looking better. All right, this is about ready to turn off and add noodles to. Let's give her a little quick taste. All right, definitely does not need salt. Needs some more pepper, so I'm gonna add a little bit more crushed pepper. Oh, sounds like moonshine's calling me. Be right back. All right, that was not moonshine. That was Mad Dog. Mad Dog's checking to see what's going on. So I, I, I set him straight. Well, we may see him later on. May do a video with him. We'll see. But uh, let me let, let me get back to this this mac and cheese. All right. So again, this is nice and creamy. And just so you know, I did add some more milk to it. Uh, oh, I think I got that on film already. I added like, uh, what, half a cup total? Something like that. Let's give it a little taste to see what it tastes like. Wow, man, that, that is kicking right there. I like that Gouda. That Gouda in there tastes great. And you can taste a little bit hint of that bacon grease that's in there. Woo! Doggy. Oh, man. Moonshine's gonna like this. All right, and here's my pasta. All right, we're gonna add a little bit of pasta to this at a time. I don't wanna get too much pasta in there. So I'm gonna add maybe a third of this. All right, let's stir that up a little bit. Let's see what that looks like. I'd rather have more sauce than, than noodle myself. If y'all make this, y'all do it the way you want. All right, I can tell we're gonna need some more noodles. All right, let's put some more noodles in there. Another third. There we are. Get that all stirred in. Man, this is gonna be awesome, y'all. And we're gonna fry this up on top of this. Woo! This is good, just like it is right here. Speaking of, let me uh. Let me turn the oven on, bake, uh, 325, eh, 350, what the heck, 350 Fahrenheit. I'm going to put this in the oven and see if I can get it a little browned on the top. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and add the rest of these. So it's one full package of these macaroni noodles here. Okay. I think this is going to work out great, y'all. Man, I almost need a bigger pot. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, man, Moonshine's going to love this. And he should be home in a little bit. Goodness gracious. Man. And if y'all can smell this. Awesome. Totally awesome. Love it. Alright, we are back. Look at this creamy goodness right here, y'all. I don't think it needs anything at all. Now, what I did, I greased this, uh, this baking sheet here, baking pan, and uh, I used some of the, the real butter that I had earlier, and I just kind of rubbed it in there. Y'all know how to do all that stuff. So, what I'm going to do this out of here. All right, now what I'm gonna do is uh, pour, or attempt to pour all this ooey gooey goodness into here. Woo. Maybe a little bit too much. Okay. Let's... All right, guys, that is some kind of good. Now, I'm fixing to put it in the oven, so I've got some of this Mexican four cheese blend. It's got uh, Monterey Jack, Cheddar, Asadero, Asadero, and uh, Queso K2. 
quesadilla cheeses. So uh, again, I'm just hope Sean doesn't mind. I'm just kind of using what he has here in the in the roadhouse, cleaning out his fridge. And we're gonna bake this off in the oven. Man, oh man, this is gonna be some kind of fine, y'all. And then we're gonna fry it off. Alright, there we go. Pop this in the oven, we'll be right back. Alright, I baked it at 350 for approximately 15 minutes, but again, everything was cooked in there, so I didn't really need to leave it in there that long. And I turned the broiler on for about four minutes, and that's why you get that, uh, that nice, nice looking color on top. So I'm going to let this cool down. We're going to stick it in the fridge, let it really cool down. You can stick it in the freezer if you want after, you know, after you can, but basically you want to cool this down as much as you can before you try to make some some balls or sticks or whatever you want to do with it it needs to be uh, really cold uh, not frozen but really cold so that you can easily handle it and so that it will stay together so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna fry it up be right back all right everybody I pulled this out of the fridge it's been in the fridge for a few hours now oh hey hey oh, bro. It's moonshine What's up, baby? Oh, Lord. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, Moonshine. Right, hey, man. I hope you don't mind. I hey. used the, I used the kitchen. That's cool, man. Sorry, y'all. Uh, I'm all front pin from work and stuff. And, uh, whew. Good Lord. Hard what day. You what you cooking? Yeah. Uh, uh, I, man, I, I, not hard day, but well, kind of. Nah, you know. I did some homemade mac and cheese, and Vanesh L. wanted me to do some fried macaroni and cheese balls. Oh, really? Yeah. You don't want it? Or? No, no, I'm still doing really? it. I, I just pulled this out of the fridge. All right. And uh, I still need to fry it up. Maybe you help me? Well, hell yeah. Okay, all what right. What do you think? Well, yeah, man. Cool. Well, hell yeah. All right. So, well, look, uh, I'm going uh, to go take a bath and uh, get cleaned up, and I'll be back, like, not this, but, you know, uh, <laughs> but, uh, I'll be back uh, with some nicer clothes on. It's my, my work stuff, but uh, I'll be back in a minute. So, uh, Go ahead on try to finish your video, man. All right, cool. Uh, Thanks, man. I'll be back in a minute, dude. All right. Hey, love you, boy. All right, love you too. Glad you're you here, man. Hey, oh, I'm a big brother. Good to see you, man. Hey, you too, man. I appreciate you having me over at the roadhouse. Hey, no problem, bro. My house is your house. Oh, thanks, you know man. You that, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Make seven right. home. Oh, yeah. Love you, bro. Love you too, man. I'll be right back. All right. So, I'm going to take some of that. I'm going to put in this egg wash. I got two eggs, a quarter cup of milk or so. And, uh, and we got this uh, this fish fry right here we're going to use. And I'm going to put that Bro. in here. Hey, let me oh. do that for you, man. Oh. Hey, I'm all cleaned up. Got a bag. Cool, man. Let me do that for you, man. Man, I appreciate that? it, bro. I appreciate it, bro. A lot appreciate of hard work, it, look. Man. Make a bed all day. This is, hey. your, this is your kitchen anyway. I don't care. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I just, just, that, 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 that. I tell you what, grease. Looks, like, looks like you made yourself a home, uh, Oh, yeah. And the grease is, oh, who is that? Oh, oh, hang on. Hang on. Hang on, y'all. All right, hang on. What's up, y'all? Oh, big, where the Big cowboy in the house? Mad dog. Hey, Mad dog. What's up, hey? What's up, what's up, what's up? Man? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Good, man. Good, man. Woo, Lord. Y'all making a video? Yeah. What we making today? Oh, we're doing some uh, Tell them, Big Troy. fried macaroni and cheese meatballs. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait. wait. Oh, yeah, mac and man. cheese meatballs? Oh, yeah, well, not mac and cheese meatballs. Ma fried mac and cheese balls. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Fried mac and cheese balls. I call baby. them meatballs right. because they got bacon in them. Oh, okay, yeah. really? Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. Cool. yeah. Hey, let's put his ass to work, man. How about that? Oh, Daryl. Daryl. You want to do the frying, man? Well, the grease is hot, man. Okay. Let's go. Assistance? Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Are you here? Uh, we need we need to take some of them uh, macaroni. Okay, this here? Yeah. Okay. And uh, I think, yeah, there you go. Get, just get you a spoon, oh, man. Oh, this one? Oh, yeah. What you yeah. Got this? That'll work. Come on, the grease is getting hot, man. <clears throat> okay. Go, go, go. All yeah. Right. Get hot, hot, hot. You know, kind of kind of like do a little ball with it. Wait, and then, hold uh, on. Is this big enough or? or no, nah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Okay. Right. Throw a little egg wash on are you it. Sure, are you sure this is too not big and big and good enough, huh? Uh. Or you want a little small? Yeah, that's 
that's about golf ball size. We're yeah, good. Roll, we're, we're good. Roll with it. Let's go. Yeah, Let's we're go. good. Chop, right. chop. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, remember, always wet and dry. Now, oh yeah, that's right. Hand stays wet. Here's town. Okay. That's right. Dry. Throw some of the fish fry Sean loves. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, babe. Well, I tell you what, I need to go ahead and do. Looks like I might need to go ahead and do a few of these at a time. Okay. Yeah. Do sure. That. Yeah. Oh, you dirty ass. I want to see some videos from I Chef Jean Robert. I cannot believe you do it. Oh, yeah. Chef Jean Robert. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to see some squirrel. He's blowing some smoke. Alligator. He's blowing smoke, boy. Alligator. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Some coon. <laughs> yep. Uh huh. That's right. I want to see some natural Louisiana cooking. Yeah, baby. right. I'm going to tell you right now. Hold on. I got some gator at the house now. Uh huh. I'm scared of that. Well, when you get your channel, <laughs> you can throw it up on the videos. There you go. Yep. All right, it's smoking. Drop it in there. Oh, Woo! yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, I hear it. I hear it. It's sizzling. Yeah. All right. Thank throw you, Mad Dog. Throw them balls around, Dog. Throw them balls around, Dog. <laughs> Thank you, Mad Dog. Throw those balls around. Woo! That's right. Uh, hey, spring clean tomorrow, babe. Oh, yeah, Woo! Oh, yeah. We're having fun at the roadhouse. At the roadhouse. Oh, yeah, Mad Dog. Pull them out, babe. About yeah. eight seconds, babe. Pull that man. Oh Pull yeah. Uh-huh. Check this out. Look, check this out. Look, zoom in on it. Zoom in on it. Zoom in, Troy. Alright, I'll zoom in. Alright. I I'm got zooming. yours. I'm zooming, I'm zooming. Oh yeah. Sorry, y'all. Alright, oh, we're zooming. Oh man. That's the first batch. That's some big balls. Let's let's let it cool off for a few minutes. We'll yeah. take some. We'll be right back. We're gonna make the rest of these, but let's just get some samples right now. That's right. You know, for, for the audience. For you yeah. for you guys. And we'll be right back. We'll be right back. Hey Moonshine. Hey. These look pretty good. Yeah, boy. They cooled off enough. Tell you what, Dad did a good job on that, didn't he? I know he did. Yeah. Oh mad dog. Mad dog. Right. Yeah. Hey man, I hate it. I'm just doing what y'all oh, told me to do. Oh yeah. I'm hungry. Let's try some of these. You want to? Yeah, let's do I'm over too. All right. Let's try some. Yeah, I, 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 I want this one right here. Woo. Grab it right well, look at that. Grab your ball. Grab your ball. Falling apart. Oh, yeah. Grab your ball. Get back. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we'll be out. <laughs> Try that a little bit. Huh? What? Hey. Let's show them. They cheesy? They cheesy balls? Oh, yeah. Uh, we don't know yet. <laughs> huh? Uh-huh. They are. Look. Good? Uh -huh. mm. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me zoom in on this. No, one. you ain't got to. I'll come okay. with you. Oh my god. I know, right? Oh man. They're falling on my hand. Go, oh, I see the what? trippings. I see the trippings. It's coming out, man. <laughs> Y'all, that's so good. Look. <laughs> Dude. Dude. Tell you what. Oh, it's got a little heat. Yeah. Does it? Got some heat to it. Yeah. Come on. I, hey, I need to try me right. one. That's jalapeno. that's jalapeno right there, y'all. See that jalapeno? Yeah, I'll tell you what. Hey, let me try one over there. Hold on. Okay. I want cool. another one. That's good, man. Yeah. Told you, man. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. Oh, good Lord. Man, y'all. Come try one of these, man. Yeah, hey. Y'all, what y'all? I'm good. Uh, who gave you the recipe? I made it up. He just grabbed yeah. me one. He yeah. just good. Dude, I made it up. That's, uh, <laughs> Hey, man dog. Man, I'll tell you what. Here, here man dog. Here, let's give this. There you go, man dog. Man dog, try that. Try that, bro. Look, I want another one. You I know, it's good, ain't it? Give me a small one, look. Mm-hmm. Go on now. Dude, oh, tastes what? good with that fish fry. Oh, man. I told, you. I told you. I know. It's good. good. What yeah. the hell? That's good, isn't it? It is good. The mac and cheese by itself is great. I'm gonna tell you right now. <laughs> Here. Oh, I know. Y'all got, go. got, got, hey, got a skinny girl. I know he's drooling. I, I know. See that? I know. I know. And the Ooh. cheese. The cheese. Bro. I told y'all earlier. That's good, man. I, don't want, I want more sauce. Awesome. I want more sauce than I want the noodle. How you like that, man, dog? That's mine. I'm gonna tell you good, what. Huh? I'm gonna tell you. Take that pan. 
I'm gonna make some more balls. I'm gonna find those suckers up. Oh yeah, and yeah. I'm gonna like that. Yeah, this sample right here. Yeah, the sampler, man. Sampler right here. Yeah, dude, this is. Oh my god, pretty good. It got a little kick to it. Tastes good, huh? Done, huh? Boy, I'll you tell feel you what, the heat? Oh yeah, the tell cake. You what? Uh, I can feel it. that cat's gonna feel it too in a little bit. Feel the heat. Oh, hey, that <laughs> dog got his hat backwards, y'all. Hey. already backwards. I, I, I'm, at, oh, yeah. I'm at Moonshine's Roadhouse. I figure I'm better. <laughs> I figure I'm better. Better go ahead and do it. Wait, get with the program. Get, <laughs> hey, get, with, get with the program. Hey, <laughs> hey we love y'all. Love y'all. We really do. <laughs> Thank y'all. Yeah, appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for subbing, subscribing, and uh, watching our vids. It's uh, yep. all good, man. It's all good. You know, it's all good. That is awesome. I'm it is. It's good. Dude. Van Vanesh, L, thank Vanesh, you, thank yeah. you for subscribing. Thank yeah. you so much for the suggestion. Yeah. And uh, Keith Bettag, I ain't forget about you, man. I'm gonna do yours too. <laughs> you Which got one? Which one? He asked me to do a, a, a macaroni and cheese. His. He asked me to do his macaroni and cheese. Oh, I think. Uh, well, I tell you what. I think you got it covered, right? Uh, uh I, I think so. But, kind of uh, sort of look. Kind of sort of look. Hey, Keith, check this out, man. Whoo! Yeah, baby. Y'all check Keith out, man. Keith Bat Tag. <laughs> That's good, y'all. It is really good, y'all. That's really. good. Really Appreciate good. it. Appreciate it. Anyway, thank y'all for stopping by, checking yes, out Space Cowboy TX. It's yeah, Troy. Yeah, right. yep. uh -huh. I'm in Moonshine's Roadhouse. Thanks, man. There you go, man. Bro, I appreciate it. Throw a little yeah. bit of milk in there, man. Hey, man, how about tomorrow? Huh? Oh, oh, oh. How about boy. tomorrow? Spring clean, my boy. Spring clean. Woo! Spring clean. Where you at, JB? Yeah, spring clean, baby. Yeah, Sancy? Hey, you think I should put a little bit of salt and pepper in here? Uh, if you want to, it, dude, this is your cook, man. You, well, you do what you want to, well, man. What, what does this have? It does have everything in it. Yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty spicy, man. Yeah, it's pretty good. All, all right, right, so I don't need I don't, to add. I don't think you need to add crap to that. Okay, all I'm right. I'm serious, man. All right, cool. You know, really. Okay. So we'll open this bag. All right, guys. And again. Y'all check it out. There you go. Yeah, we got, we got it both of them. Let me zoom up. Hang on. This stuff here is awesome, y'all. Louisiana French fry. Let me get on my camera, too. Oh, yeah. That's some good stuff, man. Really. And, uh, Mad Dog? Mad Dog. Mad Dog. Mad Dog. I'm hey, a, I'm you dry out? Huh? You dry out? Oh, I'm fine. You good? I'm good. From last weekend? Yeah, man. You sure? I'm positive. Fine. Okay. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right. All right. So, hey, he's in good shape. Yeah, he's in good right. shape. Cool. He's in right. good shape tonight, y'all. Yeah. Uh, Don't worry about Mad Dog. Yeah, Mad Dog's good. Uh, Mad Dog's good. <laughs> great cameraman. We appreciate all he's hey, done. He is. We love him to death. Appreciate y'all. Hey, Mother Brick Brother, Daryl. Yep. Love you, man. I was fixing to say, man. He's 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 a brother hey. that went from my mother. That's right. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, baby. Thumbs up, baby. We love That's you, Daryl. Right. Love you, Daryl. Mad Dog in the house, y'all. Mad Dog in the house. Can we get a? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, thank 
you all man. Appreciate it. That's right. We'll catch y'all after a while. We'll do some more videos. Love y'all. Love y'all too.